Hello, my name is Jenny Batchelder and I'm from San Antonio, Texas. I am a current second year doctoral student here at Florida State University studying higher education with a specialization in student affairs. So I'm big on family and finding time to spend with them. I also love Harry Potter and Disney, and luckily they're right nearby us. I do like to take my dogs to Lake Ella, and my partner and I like to go adventuring, either hiking, kayaking, or to the beach. I'm also a member of the Congress of Graduate Students and the Higher Education Student Association, but otherwise you'll find me studying either with a group or at the library. I am passionate about student development and leadership education, and before I started my doctorate, I worked at two small private liberal arts institutions in Texas. And my primary areas of responsibility involved student engagement and student activities, but my favorite engagement opportunities involved leadership education. So those involved campus-wide conferences, leadership workshops, trainings, both for large groups and small groups, and that really created my passion for leadership education and is what's driving my interest for leadership as my dissertation topic. So in non-technical terms, I'm interested in studying how college students who get involved on campus move through their leadership identity development. Um, the leadership identity development is actually a theoretical model, and I'm particularly interested in the fifth stage of generativity. So they reach this stage if they recognize that they're going to be graduating soon, and they want to ensure that their vision for the organization continues after they leave. So they work with the next generation of student leaders um, through mentoring in order to inspire them to have a shared vision vision and passion for their organization. And so I'm hoping to find some really great best practices and information on how to help students reach this stage through my dissertation. So of course I was looking for academic rigor and a focus in higher education, student affairs, but particularly leadership education. And so that's what really drove my choice here at Florida State. I learned that Dr. Kathy Guthrie um, was one of the faculty here in the program, and she is a strong pioneer for leadership education. I got to read a lot of her work before I started here, and um, I was really excited to learn that she had, uh, <laughs> I would have the opportunity to work with her. So I reached out to her and got to hear about the program from her perspective and what she would be able to offer me as an, advisee, an advisor for my dissertation topic, and I was sold, um, especially because it's not just the academic side. She's also able to offer um, her students uh, an opportunity for publishing and research while we're in the program, not after we <laughs> finish the program. So it was a really great opportunity and definitely a great selling point for me. I definitely had a great mentor through my previous supervisor in my graduate assistantship with Latika Young. Um, she really helped me to be acclimated to the campus and learn about the resources and just be overall welcoming as a first year graduate student and in my transition. So I really appreciated her mentoring. I also really appreciate Dr. Kathy Guthrie. She's my advisor for the program. She's been able to really give me some great opportunities to already as a first year get involved in research and that has been tremendous in helping me be successful. But my peers have actually been some of the biggest um, successors or mentors for me through my program. Um, some of the cohorts above me have been helpful and influential in helping me find the right path um, through this doctoral program with a lot of really great advice. Um, I've formed really great study groups with my cohort and several of my classmates, and so they've been really crucial to helping me su be successful this first year. Well, it's definitely challenged me even beyond what I was expecting. I came in thinking I wanted to be a director of a leadership center, which still sounds amazing to me, but I think the program has really helped me to reframe how I would approach that role. 
because the program has given me a lot of insight on policy, um, both publicly and institutionally, research and teaching. Um, all of those have just framed, uh, given my me a different mindset for how I would approach that role or whatever role comes after I graduate. So um, that's that's been really, really key and crucial. Just the coursework has really been um, rigorous and challenging and really helping me to think critically about how I, I would be intentional in each in whatever role I end up with. I've definitely enjoyed that I am not treated as a student. I have come in and been embraced as a member of staff, as a professional, even in the classroom setting. Um, of course, they all know I'm a student, so everybody's flexible with my studies and whatever I need as a student. Um, but they respect that I come in with years of experience, and they know that they can depend on me for um for my professional experience and what I can contribute to the conversations, both in my research assistantship and in the classroom. My faculty know that they can push me even further because of what they know a professional is capable of, um, so I really appreciate that. And beyond just not being treated as a, just a student, I appreciate that I've been able to take advantage of professional development here at Florida State, both on campus at really great professional institutions and conferences, uh, and also they've sent me to national conferences, and I've really appreciated the professional development opportunities here. I'd say if you want to do it, do it. Uh, it is going to be a lot of work for sure, um, and it's going to be challenging you and pushing you. It's gonna, You're going to be a little tired, but it's worth it. I think that the amount of growth that I've gotten within just the first year is tremendous and worthwhile. I am really thinking very differently about the material that I'm involved in and how I seek more knowledge um, on anything that I'm getting involved in and I really appreciate it and know it'll help me transform as a professional after I graduate. Other than that, just go for it and enjoy it. Uh, and best of luck. Thanks.